the test pumps to actually work out the exact blockage resistance of each of the different impeller designs. We do a number of different tests. We have a standard rag test in terms of putting certain quantities of rag, and we also do a lot of videoing so that we can actually understand what is happening to the rag when it goes through that impeller. The end result of that is that we actually have a completely new design on the smaller units for the contrablock. It's called the contrablock plus. If you look at the rag handling capability of that impeller, it is roughly twice the capability that we have with the existing design. It is a very, very strong design when it comes to rag handling. It is also not speed sensitive. Again, what you will see on a lot of designs is that as you reduce the speed, the rag handling actually reduces. On this design, it does not. It does not rely on a cutting action. Okay? Traditional thinking is, again, that when you want to handle rag, you have to cut it. But if you actually cut rag, it basically means that you have a high maintenance pump because that cutting action is going to go, and when that cutting action goes, you are going to see a reduction in the way that that pump handles rag. So this design does not use a cutting action. It works on the basis of taking the rag through the pump without actually having to cut. What you will also see is it still has a very large solids handling. It still has the 75 millimeter free solids passage, and it also has an efficiency level that is in line with any other product on the market at the moment. The other thing that I'd like to just talk briefly about is reliability. And what we said was that it was very, very important that we had a product that had high reliability. When we've designed this product, we have made absolutely no compromises when it comes to reliability. There are a number of features on this pump, again, that make us absolutely unique in the market. The first one that we have is these products all have a NEMA Class A temperature rise. Again, a benefit of the premium efficiency motor. What does NEMA Class A temperature rise mean? It means that these pumps run very, very cool. It actually means that if you take a pump that's below 10 kilowatts, we could stand it on the floor here, we could run it full load, and it would not actually overheat. Okay. It also means that the bearings run cooler. It also means that there is less stress on the stator. Again, very, very important when it comes to reliability. On the larger units, again, we do not need the cooling jacket on a submerged application. Again, it will run quite happily because we have the high-performing, low-temperature stator. We have a service factor of 1.3. Okay? So we've built in a very, very large safety margin to make sure, again, you get reliability. On smaller pumps, we have 50,000 hour bearing life. On large pumps, we have 100,000. We have EX as standard. Okay, we are not going to muck around in terms of EX and non-EX. If you buy the pump, you will buy the pump EX. Why do we make EX? We make EX because we know that's the right thing to do in terms of safety. We have an easy service plug on the smaller units, again, uh, to help uh, do maintenance in the field. We have a very, very good plug attachment, service friendly, which means you can still change the plug in the field, but if you need to take the pump away, you can leave the cable in situ uh, on site. Double mechanical seals, standard, silicon carbide on both seals. So from a reliability point of view, this pump again is going to be a market leader. It is the absolute best on the market when it comes to reliability. So what we're actually offering when it comes to this product is, we are going to offer a very, very high efficiency using both the IE3 motor and also an improved hydraulic. We are going to give you greatly improved rag handling, which we can support with test data. We are going to give you high reliability. We are going to give you a future-proof design, which is already in line with legislation. And we are going to give you something that is sustainable in manufacture and operation. If I come back to the very first comment I made, this is a first in the market. This is going to set a new standard in the market. Thank you. What we'd like to do is that we will take questions. Um, we can either take questions in terms of the open forum. What we hope will happen is now that you will all stay with us on the stand. Uh, my colleagues standing in the white shirts from the green ties will be very happy to talk to you in terms of more detail. If you want to get into more detailed discussions in terms of the product, then we will be very, very happy to do that. Are there any general questions?
Okay, good. If I could leave you to my colleagues, and thank you very much for listening.